Welcome back. We have mostly clear skies across the area this morning. We had a few passing clouds throughout the overnight hours and into the early morning today, but nothing too crazy. We've just had these mostly clear skies throughout the entire weekend pretty much, and we'll keep the clear skies going throughout at least the uh, portions of today. We might start to see more clouds as we go throughout the overnight hours tonight, but temperatures right now are in the mid to upper 30s. We are still hanging on at 40 degrees in Concordia, though, sitting at 34 degrees in Clay Center, Emporia, and Burlington. 39 degrees in Hiawatha this morning and 37 degrees in Topeka and Lawrence. Now, we will have a cold front push through the area later on this morning, but right now our winds are out of the south and west ahead of that front. They're running about 5 to 10 miles per hour, even up to 13 miles per hour in Concordia. But notice our winds in Concordia are out of the west. Same goes for Marysville. That means the front is approaching, and once it does, our winds will shift to the north and west and become pretty breezy for a time, especially in the later part parts of the morning into the early afternoon. So I do want to show you the potential uh, future wind gusts that we could see today. So this starts at 6 a.m. this morning. Wind gusts up to 20 to 25 miles per hour. Not uncommon as we start the day off, but as we go throughout the later parts of the morning, we could see wind gusts as high as 35 to even 40 miles per hour behind this front. So as we go throughout the day, pretty breezy throughout the early afternoon, but it doesn't last too long. Winds die down by this evening. So we do have just this brief period of some breezy weather. So if you're out traveling, just keep two hands on the wheel. It'll be pretty breezy out there for a little bit. Temperatures, though, aren't going to be affected by this front. We'll have mostly sunny skies. We're not going to have any chances for rain. The only thing it's going to do is bring us those breezier northwesterly winds. Temperatures though still climb up into the upper 40s and low 50s today. Overnight tonight we'll cool things down into the upper 20s and then we'll start to see more clouds as we go throughout the daytime tomorrow. We'll call it a mix of sun and clouds, but temperatures still pretty nice for this time of the year. We're going to top out in the mid to upper 40s and just to put that into perspective for you, we're supposed to be at 39 degrees for our average high temperatures this time of the year. So if we're about 10 degrees above average, I will take it. We have some great weather coming up for the rest of the week. The only kind of hiccup that we're going to see, our next chance for some uh, rain will be throughout the middle part of the week into the end of the week. So we'll start this run of future track at 10 a.m. on Wednesday. We'll be pretty quiet until then. And then we'll start to see more clouds filtering into the area throughout the day on Wednesday, becoming mostly cloudy as we go throughout Wednesday night and then Thursday morning. That's when we'll start to see maybe a slight chance for some light rain showers enter into the area. That pushes off by Thursday afternoon and into the evening. And then we could have a second round of some precipitation as we go throughout Friday into Saturday, possibly. That could bring us a chance for maybe some rain mixing in with some snowflakes at times. But until then, temperatures look really, really great. We'll have that mix of sun and clouds on Monday. Temperatures will be in the mid to upper 40s both Monday and Tuesday, but get a little bit colder for Saturday even. So enjoy this nice weather while we have it. We become much more seasonable by the yes. end of the week. So. <laughs>